Hello, once again, audience, and welcome back to Domination with Mac Marla and Christopher. I've got my war hat on. <clears throat> war hat. It's my war hat. Nice. I like it. Thank you. I like it too. It's a birthday present for my wife. Well, I like your kids. And my kids. But I have a hard time keeping my mohawk centered properly. Yeah. That's my only frustration with it. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. I am almost war ready, I think. I need a general. Nobunaga. I'm gonna get Cleo up to 10. Jeez. Sure, I always need more of that. <laughs> um, okay, I'm not as prepared as I'd like to be because like this morning, nothing was trained. <laughs> Did you just wing it? You're like, I'll train some of this and some of this. Be a Korean, so it shouldn't really be a problem. Yeah. Okay, so I should be going on two skills. You have the only enlightened in this war, I think. Really? Yeah, I think so. Oh, good. So it should be good. Number one's not even enlightened. Ooh. Oh, he looks kind of enlightened. He looks kind of enlightened. A little bit anyways, eh? Now... Right now. Hmm. I think I am gonna drop here. Yep. That's gotta be it. It might be a bit of a push, but gotta be there. Are you gonna take a wall sapper so you can hammer in and get that quick victory, or are you just gonna pop the strength of the gladiator on that first rally? Oh, we'll see. We'll play it by ear. We'll play it by ear. We'll wing it. I'm going to wing it. Um, Let's see. We can move that down. Yeah. Sab, sab. But not once until I get, like, in range. They're actually firing because, yeah, my sabs are so pathetic. <laughs> a short and then another sab there. And hopefully I can get both of those. You should be able to. Yeah. All right. <laughs> yours looks like fun. Yours, it looks, does. yours looks good. That's one of the ones where you would, any higher, and you would have to have something like a, a blitzkrieg to take that out. Mm. You don't have any coalitions either. I don't. Do you think I should get some? Uh, I think it's entirely up to you. Maybe I'll see if I have any. Uh, Trinkets. They're not able to star against me. Okay, well, I can get a Mongols. Sure, do it up. And that's it. Yeah. I guess we're going to have to force you to start playing more with this account, eh? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> okay, now let's real attack. I've got, you know, a coalition there. You could do me. Oh, yeah. Now it should be fine. It'll be fine. Bet you those bridge shooters are the first to die. Oh, they are squishy, aren't they? Do, 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 do. Where are those guys going? Where are those guys going? Well, did I want you to move forward and, you know, maybe take on some of those ones? Yeah. Oh, really? Isn't that nice? What's that? <laughs> that they're all going the wrong way? Yeah. Strength on. And oh. oh, I want you guys to be closer so I can get that and that. Oh, let's get like this then. That needs to go. Oh, 
I think you still have your coalition guys on, on the far right, don't you? Yeah, I do, actually. And you know what? They're good for cleanup crew, actually. They sort of blob things. It does a very nice, very nice job on uh, getting through that. I honestly wasn't sure if you're going to have enough umph to get through there because it was such a long, yeah, long drive, wasn't it? It was. It really was. You think so? Yeah, I might be. Oh, you only got eight shooters left. Yeah. But all the stuff is down. Oh, no, when it fell, I'm okay. Okay. But there's been many times where, like, you're low on troops and then um, the general pops, especially on these lower level. Yes. And then the general just kind of wanders around and kills all your stuff. Yeah, and I'm going to get some salt for this. Awesome. That's kind of neat, though. Yeah. That's a solid attack. Oh, what's left? Oh, there's something down at the very bottom. There is. Okay. 30, 30 seconds. Oh, yeah, I'm good. Absolutely solid. I'd rather on a little gold pile. Yeah, well. I'm not, I'm not you, though, and you're not me, so. It is what it is. You guys are close enough. Yeah. Ta-da! Ta-da! There it is. <laughs> I'm telling you, Koreans can take down anything. That extra tactic complemented with everything else. Uh, yeah. And the strength of uh, Russell Crowe. The strength of Russell Crowe. I mean, that's really what does it, right? It does. I'm Korean, so I can just walk right into mortar fire. Oh, I'm invincible. <sighs> well, there you go. That puts us ahead. Good. All right. I'm doing my job. Yeah, your job is done. Thanks for coming out. Ah, uh, you're welcome. I really appreciate that because it takes the pressure off of me, right? I did my good doobie and got a uh, defensive coalition. Oh, okay. So. Yeah. So let me retrain. I'm missing kids. What are you missing? Stuff. Cider. Always oh, cider. Let's just go. Oh, I actually can claim a reward. Usually it's like dismiss, dismiss, dismiss because I haven't been on in days. <laughs> um, I will let you. Well, we're playing together now, so. Yeah. And I like that. I, I've got to say, I really like I it. do too. Well, I like playing with you. Uh, yeah. I miss you. It's kind of like, you know, why we started playing the game. It but. is. Unfortunately, just like with the environment. <laughs> Your jerk of a leader <laughs> made the executive decision to kick you out. <laughs> yeah. No. I, I, well, it is. It's the environment. It's just the way it goes. Yeah. Yoink! Should we go watch me fail? Yeah. I'll, I'll farm those trees later. I won't make you guys watch. <laughs> Tonight, we're farming trees. To get cider. Do, do, do. Oh. oh man. Happy Monday. Yeah, it's a Monday. But that was an awesome war attack. Yeah. Like really? As a highlight to your Monday, that was an awesome war attack. It, it, it felt good. It, it made my Monday significantly better. It should have. Why? Oh, because I donated a whole bunch of stuff, so we're going to... Uh, yeah, you donated to me. I did. All right. I nommed my target. Did you nom your target? You didn't even nom your target. Bad. I, I'm sorry. Bad, Marla. You can take away my crown points. All right, here. Let's. I'm sorry, I didn't do my job really. I never got a part. I'm gonna scout this guy. You won't. Right. I've scouted him before because it's actually a, an interesting looking base. And I guess, you know, I do take that for granted as I'm just used to playing with people who are experienced, so, like, and know me, but, like, really not very many people know me well in this, uh, alliance. I kind of just go. So, do we have a, we have a drawing thing? No, there's no drawing thing. Yeah, there is. There should be a drawing screen, because this is your old account. Oh, it 
is too. Look at that. There you go. You can draw. I'm going to draw. Here we go. We're drawing. Uh, we're going to be dropping right there. We're going to be doing a sab right there. Uh, hopefully this will bring our troops forward enough that we can actually, like this sab is supposed to encompass that. Um, those are some pretty stout walls. But if I rally right there, uh, I can hit that town center. And then I can just go one way or the other. Mm -hmm. You're probably going to need to stab that because you're British. And if you rally there, it uh, might be in range and they'll all die. Uh, let's see. Let's go. So this one. I made that mistake. One, That's two, Christmas. three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, one. Yeah, so that's that's yeah. probably it there. So if I if I go there. So you could stab there when you to stab the town hall, you can stab that one as well. I'm actually thinking if I rally right in this corner. Oh, okay. Then I should be clear of that. Okay. If I'm not, it's one of the weaker. It's a. It's just a little one. I can handle one hit. But we'll have to keep an eye that's out. That's it. Actually, you know what? I'm going to have to sab it anyways. I'm going to have to sabotage that anyways. So, uh, one sab, rally, one sab. There you go. Yeah, good. Good. Oh. There we go. Okay. Oh, we should be good. Yeah. yeah. It looks good. I'm looking, I keep always look at these things with the Merc camps and whatnot, and I'm like, this guy's got resistance. Oh no, wait a minute. <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> I was just talking. We were just talking the other night about, like, not attacking IAs, and this last war I had an IA to attack a lower level than me. So. Here we go. I'll save my offensive mercs. There you go. For clean up. For, from your coalitions. Yeah. We can pull Marla way back here. Uh, well, that's the point with the um, range troops. You want them far away so they're not taking damage. That's right. Oh, see, we missed that anyways. You did. Yeah, that's good. That's firing. There's the quick victory. Do we want to just pummel through those walls? I don't really feel like we should be pummeling through those walls. Let's just go right up here. Yeah. Let's go do your dance. Your British dance. My British dance. Right away from the shooter buildings. Oh no, the shooters are coming. The shooters are coming. Yes, that is the British dance. In his mind. There it is. Got a full on two minutes here. And never forget, those readouts can be quite scary. In his mind, let's go. Uh, let's go hang out up here, please. Get healed up a bit. Yep. You have that, to take a few hits. Let that mahoot. Take it on, yeah. Let him do his thing. Take the hits. And that's what he's there for. I mean, yeah. And now my only concern is that there's this uh, cannon tower. Complement with the cannon tower, I'm sticking under the Versailles. Yeah. Which is a little bit of a scary one. 
that should put us out of range of everything. And then I should be able to just work from up here as well. Yeah. Oh, those are going to die. Those are going to die. Yeah, because they can't. They can't defend themselves. No, they can't. But they're kind of cool, actually. They're, they're neat looking. They're cute, anyways. Yeah. Uh, what do we think? We get a... Honestly, I want to get that down and that down. 30 seconds left. We'll go ahead and rally on this bad boy here. And that should put us... Yeah, there we go. So minimal losses, really. I'm pretty happy with that. My war attacks seem to be going all right as far as using the British. My loot, however, like my standard attacks, uh, are not very good at all. Yeah, but like you do, you have to pull your troops out. And I have a hard time doing that because my primary account is Greek, so as a result, I'm, I just want to put my head down. It's the mohawk on the hat. It's like, go into the mortar fire. There we go. So now... I believe I just need to retrain. There's my mercs. There's those guys. And my biggest cost or expense is going to be my tactics, which is good. So there we go. Uh, how are we looking? We got 64 stars with 19 out of 30 attacks. Nice. Uh, they've got 58 stars with 19 out of 30 attacks. And my claim to fame here is that their number one went on me and got 34% no stars. So that makes me happy. I'm uh, very impressed with their number two. Usually they have to send down an IA to get my base. So that is very impressive. That's, the well, very solid. Yeah. Their number two is obviously, like, their, that's their pro star, obviously. Because um, that's, that's an enlightened, yeah. That's an enlightened that took a little finger and you. Uh, I'm sure if that person had an attack left, they'd be like, yeah, go take one if you could, please. Uh, but let's see what we got left, because we're going to be going in here in a little bit anyways. Uh, little finger solid. So yeah, we might have to wait a while for my troops to return, because I don't have many crowns. Four, five, eleven, fourteen and fifteen. 4, 5, 11, 14, and 15. Well, there you have it. That's good enough. I have lots of crowns. Do you want some of my crowns? I can just transfer them over. Yeah, sure. <laughs> if only, right? All right. Well, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Uh, as always, keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time.